Good day and welcome back to another DB Legends video. In this video we are going to take a look at the new Goku, Gohan and Goten Day event that has come to Dragon Ball Legends. So part of that event is obviously the summoning tickets. There are a whole bunch of tickets that you can get to summon on a very special Goku banner. Now, obviously there's a chance for Legends Limited characters, but realistically speaking, you're probably not going to get them. But there are a couple ways to get these tickets, and I'm going to tell you how to get all the tickets for the event. It is very easy and very straightforward. You shouldn't have an issue. So the only two events that do kind of matter, or at least matter in inverted commas, the first one is the Let's Fight Battle event. Obviously this drops one ticket per stage, you need to make sure you do it every single day. So you can grab tickets from the Let's Fight event but also from the missions for the Let's Fight event as well. So make sure you do that event every single day, you'll see it here. You get one ticket from the event but you also get some tickets for your cumulative attempts at it. So make sure that you do that as much as possible. Then. The second important event or the second important thing to take note of, there's a whole bunch of challenges for winning one time with a Super Saiyan character, Freezer Saga character, Goku character, Son family character. There's a whole bunch of tickets for winning with X episode type of character. Don't worry about this. Easiest way to get this done, especially for new players, is to do this The Legend of Goku event. So if you fight The Legend of Goku, most players will have done, I will be doing an event on it. I'll do a like little recap of it for a, another video. But essentially you fight throughout Goku's kind of appearances. You start with Saiyan Saga, you go Freezer Saga, you go Majin Buu, you go Cell Saga, then Majin Buu Saga, then Realm of the Gods, and then Resurrection F. And basically um, you essentially are done. So if you just do this event, you will finish every single one of those missions. Not even the daily repeat battles, not anything like that. If you just do this event, you will essentially finish all of those missions in one go. So it's very, very easy, very straightforward, very helpful overall. Uh, and I definitely highly suggest doing it. I'm just going to demo uh, a stage. This is the stage you get at the end whereby you can earn Zenkai awakening power for the blue spirit bomb Goku that you can get from the rare metal shop but basically it's very straightforward uh, you're going to clear up most of the requirements so a lot of the requirements are for using episode and transformations so for example using uh, a super saiyan god transformation unit but also there's one for doing you know, sagas from the movies, for example. Uh, you'll get most of these, pretty much all of them done from this event. So if you are doing this event for the first time, this will make it very easy for you. I highly suggest that you do it. It's the easiest way to get most of the missions done. You don't even need to like think too hard about it or anything like that. It, it's very much very straightforward and you'll be able to get it done and then you will have all of the tickets. There are 44 tickets in total uh, alongside the tickets you'll get from running the Let's Fight events as well. So there's a good couple multi summons on this Goku Gohan Day banner. So you shouldn't really have a difficult time getting all of the summons and the summons are quite worth it. Like I say, maybe you won't be able to get a Legends Limited character but you should be able to grab least some good units and free summons are always great uh, especially in legends because you know summons that you get that are characters you do have will generate coins for you to at least get equipment and things like that so for the most part it is entirely worth it and you should definitely do it i will go through the events in another video it is really straightforward it's relatively easy uh, you don't need to do anything too crazy or anything like that um, there's not like a whole bunch of things you can and can't do uh, essentially I'll show you how to start it with a free-to-play team and then I'll show you how to slowly change that team over time to complete all of the challenges but the event itself is r pretty good um, and it's a really great pickup for new players it gives you a good strong event exclusive unit for a lot of different transformations and sagas uh, the Goku units themselves, it's not like they mesh into one giant team. 
Uh, I think they are episode specific and transformation specific. So you can't just slowly accrue the Gokus and stick them all into one team. Uh, unfortunately, that's not the idea to give you one whole mega team. Uh, but they are still pretty decent units and they are pretty decent options. Especially when you're looking for units nowadays for all the kind of a range of challenges that we have full power battle, battle gauntlets, things like that. Um, there's plenty of need now, more so than ever, for a big box of you know, Zenkai plus Zenkai 14 units. So definitely uh, I do suggest that you do this event if you haven't done it already. Uh, but again, the summons are also gonna be entirely worth it. There's some really good units on there. Uh, there's SS3 Green Goku, who's Zenkai's, there is the uh, yellow Super Saiyan, full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku, who's still a powerhouse to this day, especially alongside a uh, green SS4 Gogeta. So there's a lot of still good pickup value units there that you can use and that you should should want to pick up. Like you should feel pretty good about picking them up. They're gonna help you out a lot, and yeah, just realistically speaking you're gonna be good to go. So I highly suggest that you do pick it up. I highly suggest you do this event. It's gonna help you out, it's gonna do well. You're gonna enjoy it, you're gonna get good rewards. And the tickets are honestly a focal point, but also if you do this event and you do the ticket event, then you're getting a good byproduct from both. You're gonna get uh, five or six really great units from this event. And in the process, you'll get the tickets and then in getting the tickets, in the process you will get a whole bunch of these guys so yeah pretty straightforward pretty easy so i definitely suggest doing it a hundred percent um and yeah overall uh, i think ticket missions are very easy and straightforward they don't last very long so make sure that you do get it done uh, you don't want to take too long to get it done you do need to get it done um you need to make sure that you get all these tickets because it's not up forever i think it's only up for a short while uh, so you're going to want to get that done get those tickets get those summons in quite early so try and prioritize them as quickly as you can um you don't want to be left with three summons on the table uh, it's never a good idea it's never something that anyone really wants so yeah definitely do suggest prioritizing this making sure you get it done but yeah, that's pretty much it. Everything else is pretty straightforward. Um, we got it all done, all good to go. Everything's looking really solid. Um, didn't get all my challenges done there. It's not the, I was just showcasing you guys a fight. Uh, also, just so you can see, uh, when we go back to the mission screen, you guys can see that the missions did update. Uh, we did manage to get some changes there and just to show you how it works. So you can knock out a lot of these with this uh, event right here everything gets tallied up there's plenty of other ways i mean you can do it however you want you can run a goku team you can run a this team you can do story mode whatever way suits you uh, you're welcome to do uh, it's entirely up to you so you do it but yeah uh, but that is pretty much going to be it for me guys like i said the banner looks pretty good you can find it under the tickets the ticket summon screen uh, so you can find it there but yeah that's going to be it for me i hope you guys enjoy the video and i will see you guys in the next one so until then take care stay safe and as always i'll see you guys next time so bye